Hi, I'm G. And I'm Michelle. And we are the, the Ben Pickers. Pickers. How are you guys doing today? Good, good. Good, good, good. Are you off today or what? Oh, man, I've been off all day. Okay. Uh, so. So, my friend Terry. Well, it's like a family friend. Wait, was she my friend too? Okay, your friend too. Our friend Terry. We've known her for like ever, seems like. Since the 90s, right? Back in, or, or not Oregon, Michigan. She's from Michigan, yeah. yes. So I used to live in Ann Arbor. She lived in Ann Arbor. We'd all, you know, my family, we knew her from church and everything. Anyway, um, so yeah. She's a great Family lady. friend, yes. Yeah. Very, very sweet. And she actually said, hey, I have some stuff. I've been cleaning out my closet. I have some stuff for you. Can I send it to you? You know, you can keep it, sell it, donate it to, back to Goodwill or donate to Goodwill, whatever you want to do. I'm like, hey, yeah, I'll take free stuff. So we're going to do a haul on that, and we're also going to show some stuff we got at the bin. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And we might actually have another haul this week because brand new bin opening this week. Yes. So we'll probably go to that. Yeah. Well, let's get through what she sent us first here. She's so cute. She said she got her wine subscription. So she had a... Thanks, Terry. I love his paper. So she had a big enough box to send me stuff. So this is stuff from her closet. It's from right? her closet, yeah. So Worthington Woman 20 20W. W. Look how cute that is. I did tell her there might be some stuff I might want to keep. That is very cute. I know she um, she's definitely more professional dress. She's more that, professional. Yeah, than she you. always looks like super nice. Every time you see her, her hair is like perfect. She has matching everything, all her clothes. You know what I mean? Everything matches. She, well, she's always, like, looks very nice. Does that make sense? This is a cute. What was this? Uh, Talbot Stretch. 18. 18. Made, made in, in Japan. Japan. Mm. It feels super That's nice. Weird, huh? and Why she, is it made She in has Japan? kitties. Or not kitties. She has cats. She has cats. They're very, very funny cats. She posts stuff, and I always have to laugh, because her cats, like, they make faces... <laughs> you laugh at her cats? Yeah. So this is great size stuff, too. J. Jill Extra Large. Look how cute that is. Is this a dress or is this a shirt? It's like a t dress tunic. So wouldn't that be cute with, like, black tights and some black boots? Uh, this, sure. It even has pockets. Cute. Very cute. <laughs> <gasps> this is pretty. It's so pretty. Rose would like this stuff. But I know, it, but it's too big for her. Fit her anymore. It's dress uh, barn. Dress barn. Size twenty. Size twenty. Which is a great size. Um, look at the skirt, and it even has pockets. Has a cute little belt. Look how cute this is. This mm -hmm. bow. Adorable. Okay. Moving on. This is big, heavy. North style. One X. So is that? I think that's like. You order online or through catalog. It's a nice long it's a dress. That's a dress. Um, right? Dress, yeah. Okay. Nice. I like the color on that one. I asked her. I said, "If you send it to me, oh, can I do a, a haul purse. video on it?" She said, "I could." So I'm like, "Okay." This is purse. cute purse. Has a little dust bag with it. No. Here it is. It's just like a dome kind of purse. I'm not sure. Just men's casual wear. wear. I'm not sure. What Maybe like an Amazon kind of thing. So it has this little strap on it. Uh -huh. It's kind of like a sea foam greenish aqua y. Okay. Just satchel. Cute. Okay. Someday I'm gonna, back I'm gonna use a purse like that. You are? Someday. Well, there's a card too. Aww. Well, you go to the next thing. Shell and G. And she's sweet. Uh, let's see. What well, you know, we don't is. live that far from her. It's like we should go up there. Next time I go to Michigan. Cynthia Raleigh, woman, 1X. This is a dress. She said cleaning out her closet is one positive of the pandemic. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. Yeah. Oh, sorry. What is this? Cynthia Raleigh. Raleigh. Oh, woman. Yeah, that's good. 1X. 1X. That's a cute little palm tree or palm leaf print. It looks comfy. Yeah, it does. I know he got me a dress at the bin. It was just Old Navy, but it was like caught and stretch. I wore it yesterday, I guess. It was so comfortable. Uh -huh. Premise dresses, 1X. This uh -huh. is cute. Look at that. And it's like stretchy. Uh -huh. It's like a dot pattern. 
I know, like, Rose probably would have wanted some of these, but then she lost a bunch of weight. So I guess I just need to lose some weight so I can wear some of these. There you go. But I'll sell them. <laughs> if it, this is Cynthia Raleigh, too. So it's extra, extra large. large. That's good. Yeah. That's cute. Yeah, like, you don't usually dress that fancy. I don't dress that fancy. She was always, every time I've seen her, she always looks nice. Mm -hmm. Jones, New York, 16W. Like a basic career skirt, navy blue. Mm -hmm. At my niece's wedding. Wait, blue? She, it's blue, isn't it? Maybe it's black. No, it's navy blue. Uh, it's almost black. Almost black. She, at my niece's wedding, she actually played the piano. Remember at Abby's wedding? She played the piano? Yeah. Well, yeah, I, I remember that. You know, this is cute, too. Talbot's, Talbot's 1X. Petite. 1X Petite. That is nice. I like, like, Talbot's plus size usually does good yeah. for, I mean, we would get this. Bro, Rose likes Talbot's. I know, she does. I mean, we would get, like, most of his plus size stuff. She did say there was going to be a Mickey Mouse hoodie in there. Okay, here it is. It's got some fuzzies on it. It does have some fuzzies. <gasps> but it is XXL. Disney shopping. Yeah, Terry, I think I'm going to have to keep that. Oh, okay. Mickey original. I love it. She did say she had a mickey mouse or a disneyland thing and here's the last wait it says keep digging more wine below more wine <laughs> i didn't find any wine well she says she gets her subscription so she's gonna start saving stuff so she can send us more stuff this is skirt oh yeah this feels really cool it's almost like cold water creek extra large it feels like a wool blend or something mm -hmm. it's like knit that is really cute pleated oh that's such nice stuff Thank you, Terry, Terry. thank you so much. That was I so love nice. it. Yeah, so I'm going to have to get that stuff listed, except the Mickey. Um, well, we went, remember, we went to Disneyland. This is before I had kids, I think, before we even had any kids. Remember, she went to Disneyland? She did? Yeah. Yeah. She was no, there, I and do we went to that. Disneyland. Yeah. And she met my sister a couple times. They went that to Disneyland. That was like a long time long ago. Long time ago. I know we haven't seen Terry in quite a while. She actually worked at the hospice. Um, because she was like hospice director yeah. that your aunt was at. Yeah. I, I'm wondering if... That's the last time... No, because then we saw her in Utah. But Did we? I remember seeing her and it was really great because, you know, it was like his aunt, she was there. But then I also had Terry that was there. So I kind of got to, you know, like lean on her a little bit because she was there. And yeah. um, so still, I appreciate her being there with that. So thank you again, Terry, yes, for all that thank stuff. thank you. Okay, the rest of the stuff is what we got at the bend, dollar yeah. twenty nine a pound on Shadeland. That's mm, not anymore. It's no more. So now we'll have to go to the one on forty second. North Face Women's Extra Large. Oh, it's a woman's? It does need some defuzzing. Yep. It says it's a woman's. Okay, I got this for my dad. Because it said three M on the back. He actually uh, retired from working at three M. He did? Well yeah, didn't he? Well, he worked at 3M. I don't know. He gets some pension. One size fits all. Sportsman. The best thing, when he worked at 3M, he could always get, like, Band-Aids, you know, Post-it notes, Scotch tape, all that stuff. They had, like, an employee store when they were in Minnesota. And they would be able to, they would get all that stuff, remember? Uh, sure. Do you, you probably don't remember. I guess I didn't, I didn't know you then. Yeah, so it's hard But wait, my mom this. still had a bunch of that stuff. Yeah, but they have Band-Aids that are from 1990, and they don't work very good. <laughs> oh. Nike Dry Fit Medium. Nike Pro, yep. I don't even remember what we got. This was a couple days Pink ago. Pink size small. So, I was, um, <clears throat> a sequence. Isaac is working on his program. So, I was making some videos, because he's going to have a YouTube channel, and have like how you do it and everything like that. So I was working on doing some listings so you can show, like show how it, I list, you know what I mean? Yeah. And I would just, one of those things was pink and I listed it last night and then I got an offer right away on Macari. Seems like Macari mm -hmm. is definitely the place to sell pink stuff. Okay. I'm going off subject now. Glamorized uh, sports bra. Is that what it is? I think so, isn't it? Uh, 44 DD. Yep. Nice. Glamorized sports bra. Has a little snag right here. Got it off. 44DD. But this one, nursing, right? 
Look at that. It's not nursing. It's just adjustable. Why, why do you? Why do they have this if it's not nursing? But there's not. You can't. Nothing. See. Well, that's wasted then. Wasted. It's just so it's adjustable. So if you want to pull it a little tighter, maybe you get more. That's weird. Um, isn't it? It's like a nursing bra. Yeah. No, but like high. You know, like a higher impact. Uh, maybe it'll hold you together, down a little bit more. Mix. This. Well, this was new with tags or something, wasn't it? Or no? I think so. It's like so. a mohair. What is it? Um, Avoca hand weavers made in Ireland. Mohair wool. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, that's cool. It's a lap blanket or something. Is that what it is? Or is it a scarf? Or? It could be like a blanket or it could be like a wrap kind of thing. Okay. See, this reminds me of something Terry would wear. This does? Well, like I've seen her like she wears scarves and wraps and stuff. Yeah. What is this? This is Philip Lim for Target. 3.1 yeah. Philip Size Lim. Size large. Let's do a tag. It says, what does it say in the front? Boom. Somebody that... Boom. Somebody else on YouTube had these. I remember they showed it in a whole video. And now I can't remember who it was. Huh. Shoes. Merrill. Uh-huh. Or Merrill, however, whatever you want to say it. I have glasses today. These are like real eight. strong ones. Oh, we'll see. Size eight. Yeah, women's eight. They're kind of a strappy. I usually sell these kind of like the Tiva ones like this. I'm not sure on um, the Merrill ones like that. I haven't, we haven't had it for a while. This is a beach cover up. Beach cover up. Wave zone, one size. Which I think it's is new a tag. Kind of like a cheaper brand. But I mean, yeah. I'll list it out for 15 bucks. We usually sell the beach cover-ups. I mean, stuff but like getting... But it's probably not getting time for that. True. After today. There's another strapless bra. Curvation. 42D. This is kind of funny, isn't it? The mountain. The mountain, size large. But it says, Big Mountain White Fish, Montana. Mm -hmm. You ever been there? Been there. I have been there too. Well, I, we usually drive through there. But I the guess. back says new rule: never attempt at 1080 after 420. What does that mean exactly? It's 1080. Yeah, no, I get it because the guy's snowboarding. After 420. I guess after you get high or whatever, shouldn't be doing that kind of stuff. Huh. Okay. Well, I thought this was a skirt, but that's... No, it's sweet. a shirt. And I only got it because it was new with tag plus size. Is and it? It, I thought it was cute enough to get. 2X. Which is... Unique. Spectrum. Spectrum. Yeah, I mean, it's cheapy. I'll probably take off this Roses tag. Roses. They have cheap clothes like that. I've never been in a Roses, I don't think. I don't know what it is. Or maybe we did go to one in North Carolina. But I don't think here we've been in one. So there was hmm. actually two of these Lane Bryant dresses. The other one didn't have the belt, so I didn't get it. Lane Bryant 22. It's so pretty. It's like this chiffon-like material with this chiffon. ruffle. And then the hem like goes a little bit longer on the sides. Uh -huh. Of course, I held that to me, and I'm like, I'm too short. The sides so, drag. If I'm remembering right, we got some vintage stuff in here. We did get some we don't, vintage stuff. We don't get a lot of that. True. Lately, but I think we get did get some vintage things that are fun, like this apartment nine. It's not vintage. In an apartment mine, uh, nine is just like J.C. Penney yeah. or something or Kohl's. No. It says 2018. Kohl's. That's vintage, right? No, cool. But this was cute enough to get. It's like a poncho with these, um, you know, like a toggle button. Yeah. So and it was new. So we got it. This really sweet lady came up to me, and she's like, give this to your husband. I watch your videos. <laughs> what, does she so... want me to model them? No. To model it? It's a jock strap. I love it. I was, like, cracking up, and I didn't get to see her again to tell her thank you again. So thank you Because so I much. already opened it up and took it out. I'm wearing it. No, right you're not. It's in there. It's not oh. an old one. Um, it's but... 3M. Look at that. <laughs> it's a jock strap 3M. That's funny. Size medium. Bower and black. Which we, we pick those up if we see them new. It just was so funny because you and your jock straps. 
Huh. I gotta tell you, I got a message today on eBay and somebody's like, I just watched your YouTube video. Do you have any more of those vintage pampers or thick diapers? Like, we sold those diapers like two years ago. Why has it been that long? Yeah. And somebody watched a video and then sent me a thing on eBay. I'm like, I wish I had those old diapers. Yeah. <laughs> we haven't seen any since, huh? Under Armour size medium. Women's. Women's. It's storm, storm like a hoodie. Sweatshirt. It's really soft on the inside. But those diapers were like 80s. Yeah, like 1984, I think. And if just a few were missing, I think, from the pack, right? No, I think it was full. I think it was completely was full. Was it full? I think they were all in there. Maybe, I, maybe I just remember one that was day. Missing. Plain as day, he's like, you want these diapers? And I'm like, I'm going to put these old pampers on my kid. And then he was like. <laughs> I'm going to sell them. Yeah, right? I don't remember how much we sold them for. Nine. I'm not sure. If it was 900, 900 700, or... I don't remember. This is Under Armour Kids, right? Reversible um, jacket. Is it reversible? You large. Maybe it's not reversible. Uh, no. Nope. Not it has fleece on the inside though I did get a pair of shoes they actually look pretty nice they're a little little dated style Manalo Blahnik blah Nick is that how you say it sure but they actually look pretty nice like on 38 the and a half and they're like a tweed and they have this really cool like I don't know a little gem thing here 100 but bucks made in Italy I don't think so I wish I'm not really sure because they are kind of like an older style but still really cute with this little kitten heel there yeah what's this? returns will only be accepted if the sticker remains attached it's attached try to return it but it's like somebody kept that sticker and left it on like and then put it back because they walked there you think that a sticker would be hmm maybe they tried to turn it, take them back i don't know why we got this I got Lafayette this. 148. It's size a size 12. 12. I love the color of it. It's a, like a blazer jacket. He didn't want to get it. I'm like, I'm it getting it. It is a blazer it. jacket. It has um, like light shoulder pads. Shoulder it's pads. a pretty color. Very pretty. We need to be like everyone else and send stuff to thread up. People do really well with that brand there. Do they? These are new attack scrubs. Yeah. Men's, women's. Landau. I think they're like either. Large, they're... tall. Flare. So. Flare. men's women's i'm not sure i think under the uniform section in ebay you can put like unisex unisex mm -hmm. i got this for me you got this for you what is it it's this really nubby no i'm not like a hugest fan of yellow but i can feel like mcthrifty rachel she wears it? this color and likes it 2x 3x it's like it's rachel I think it's probably just Rachel. But it's like this nubby cardigan. Isn't it like perfect for fall? Oh, yeah. I thought it's cute. That, that is lovely. This is cuter. Moth. This is cute. Yeah, but I can't wear a size medium. Moth size medium. I think it's a tunic, dress tunic something. I can't remember what it was called, but it's definitely wool blend. Yeah. Um, some people had them on super high and some people had them on 20 bucks. Hmm. So this is Isaac Mizrahi, New York, which is not Isaac Mizrahi Target or Isaac Mizrahi Q Live, which is QVC. So this you would get at like Nordstrom or something, right? Macy's, I'm not sure. I got them at the bend. I don't know. I know where you got them. I feel like you're setting on me a little. Sorry, I didn't mean to. Okay. Here's some of our vintage stuff. I'm just a kid trapped in this 50-year-old body. 1982? Is that what it says? 92? Uh, 88. 1988. Oh, yeah. It's single stitch. I, I Is it a Screen Stars? What is the brand? Yeah. Yeah, it's Screen Stars. Mm -hmm. so in I the saw, USA, 50-50. Um, it's like perfect for me, except I'm not quite 50 yet, but I'm Well, once really you are, close. you should totally wear that. Yeah. Because it's totally you. I am just a kid trapped in this. Sorry, Ben. 30 something body. <laughs> right? Right. I didn't even look these up. We used to do okay with these Ezra Fitch ones. 34, 32. The men's Abercrombie. They have distressing. 
made that way. Right? No, yeah. I, and I don't know what they go for now. Like, they're kind of made distressed here. Yeah. Um, but they're, they're a nice pair of jeans. Nice pair I mean, of jeans. Besides the holes. <laughs> These need some polish Teva. on them, but they're men's Teva boots, right? Size nine. nine. So they're like a, I don't know what style that is. I can't even think of it on the top of my head, but I'll use some magic eraser to get this clean. And um, I don't know if we have any. You always say that. I'm not one time seeing you. I know. And then I'm like, I'm going to do that. And then I, he takes a picture of the shoes and before they're wiped off or anything, I'm like, well, I guess the next person can wipe. Here's your cool mohair sweater. This is old. I mean, it just feels old. Well, remember, but there's there's no tag. No, there's no brand. It just tag. says hand wash. So you had one that was gray that was all mohair and big drift thrift. Allison sent me a message. She said, "Hey, that's probably really good because Kurt Cobain wore one at the yeah, you know, the MTV Unplugged or whatever it was. This and is he probably actually wore good. he actually wore green. Yeah. So this one has a design on it, but I still think it's probably pretty good i mean i'll probably price it pretty high just because it is the green even though it has a design on it what's pretty high i don't know it doesn't have a size or a brand what would you think i was thinking size? like 150 well, bucks 150 bucks that's probably what i'd price this it is probably a, a medium. medium and it is really cool it has that grungy kind of look grungy we'll look. see what happens so here's another Kind of vintage, right? 1991. But what does this say? So it's an artist. It's this an Murray artist. lady person. But I don't know who it is. Die Yuppie Scum. So when you look up Die Yuppie Scum, all that comes up is that Charles Manson shirt with like him and it says that on it. Did he say that? I mean, I, I don't I know. I don't know. And this obviously is not Charles Manson. And this is from Size the medium. 90s. So. 91. Early 90s. I'm not sure. I don't know either, but it's really cool. And it's like I think brand it's, new almost. Like I think it's probably pretty decent. It's good decent. condition. Same with this. Like I don't know what this is. It's old. It has some spots. What does that even say Single on the front? Single stitch. Dick Kuiper. I don't know. It was some alcohol, vodka or something oh, like that. Oh, that is? Yeah. It's some alcohol. <laughs> it must be when they came out with some new peppermint flavor of it or something. That's why. Peppermint, so cool, it's twisted. Who knows? Mm -hmm. Extra large. <clears throat> Another vintage sweater. Izod Lacoste, size large. This too is like a grandpa sweater. <clears throat> it really is. My grandpa used to wear sweaters like this. He did? Yeah. Not Izod, did he? Not Izod. I don't remember if he had any little logo on there. Hmm. Grateful Dead. I was super excited when I found this, right? Because it's on a Screen Stars tag. It's pretty, was which I thought it's, meant it's, it was older. It's 94. Yeah. 1994. Extra large. Has some And on the back it. it says, some are grateful. And then it says, summer. Dead. And then it has like their two or cool. things around right. it. And then somebody had one on Etsy for like a hundred and something. So this is that like bound to cover just a little more ground. Has that yeah. wheel on it. Extra large. It's tie dye. It I has think a it's, few holes. I think it's worth a hundred bucks. So hopefully, I mean, that'd be awesome if it's worth a hundred bucks. I was surprised to find it like a Grateful Dead on a screen stars. There was a lot of vintage pickers there. So I was surprised. Yeah. This uh, was just Daisy Kingdom. So is this good? I don't know. Anymore? It's a no-sew fabric applique. It's cute for Christmas. Yeah. Somebody might want this to make a little apron. Cute. Just iron with fusible web and finish with stick or slick paint. Adorable. 100% cashmere made in Scotland. It's like a no brand though. No it's just brand. A, um, just a big cashmere rip scarf. Rip off Burberry scarf. It's rip off? Well, no. Okay, last but not least. A real vintage Lisa Frank binder. Is it good? Some it's of those are good. It's a poodle, it, right? Yeah, it doesn't have unicorns. No. I don't think that's a poodle. That's like a Maltese or a... Okay, a dog. Um, How's that? It's a dog. <laughs> um, but it's one... a Stuart Hall 
It's definitely like late Kansas 80s, Missouri, early 90s, right? In the USA. And at least Frank was a little bit after me. You know, I mean, I was more in school mm. in the early 80s. I think this is more late 80s, but I'm talking about grammar school when you have a binder like this, right? But some of these binders, I mean, 50, 60 bucks people are selling for. Yeah. So we'll see what happens. I had some Lisa Frank stickers I got one time at the bin. You should put it with it. I don't know what I did with them. They're probably in this pile of stuff over here. That's what we got. That's what we got. And we got stuff from Terry. Terry, thank you so much yes, again. We really again, appreciate Terry. it. Um, um, we're going to get some of this stuff listed. Hopefully, we'll see. We've oh, we busy. are. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, we'll work on that then. Okay. Sounds good. Okay, and um, maybe one more haul this week. We'll see what we get when we go to the if brand we, new bin that's just opening. Yeah, we'll see. I'm not sure we'll see exactly how that goes. when we're going to go. but Okay, and we'll keep you posted. So thank you for watching. We really appreciate it. Hope you guys are having a great week. And thank you again to our friend Terry. And thank you to the people that donated stuff to the bin so we could go get it. <laughs> yeah, thanks yeah. for that, for right? sure. Pick outside the box. Thank you. See you later. God bless you guys. Bye. Bye.